the key. Sure. It's time for another cookbook review. Today we're reviewing the WW Healthy Kitchens 100 Slow Cooker and Instant Pot Recipes. Delicious, easy meals for busy days. Bonus air fryer ideas. Updated for my WW, which is green, blue, and purple. This is the one that they were giving, what is it giving, that you earned in the wellness wins. It was the first tier. I think that's 1,200 or 1,500 wins. The, whatever the first tier is, this was the cookbook du jour for this time around. It's smaller than the last one, like in, you know, but it's still pretty thick. I haven't opened it yet because I thought I would do this on camera because, you know, I am a cookbook fiend. <laughs> yeah, you know, I had to get it. You know, I have like a million cookbooks, but I don't have this one. And I earned it. So let's see. All right. Ooh, risotto style barley and peas. I open up to that. That is the first picture. Would help if I wore my glasses now, wouldn't it? Because we want me to read these things correctly. There we go. There we go. Contents. Look at the pictures. I love pictures in my cookbooks. Introduction, keys to slow cooker success, instant pots, know-how, air fryer basics, the best part, leftovers, about our recipes. Chapter one, breakfast and brunch. Chapter two, vegetarian mains. Chapter three, updated classics. Chapter four, global favorites. Chapter six, meals for two. I get asked that a lot, having making meals for one or two. It's a great chapter. Bonus chapter, instant pot and air fryer specials. And there's an index by smart point values and a regular index. Yeah, I like that. So it's kind of, again, like the last cookbook. And I know a lot of people didn't like that, but I really liked it. It's giving you more than a cookbook. It's giving you tools. I think that's really great. If you're just starting out on WW, if you're just starting out, in cooking, like say you lived with your parents or you know you never lived on your own and you don't really know how to cook. Not everybody's born to know how to cook. So I love the fact that it's giving you, you know, some tools. Tailor recipes for slow cooking. Slow cooker frequently asked questions. Instant pot know-how and instant pot frequently asked questions. Because we all have these questions. Air fryer basics. Air fryer frequently asked questions. The best part, leftovers. Storage times for cooked food. This is a big thing. How long can you keep something? Yeah. Sometimes people keep things when they eat. Yeah. Not good. Not good for the tummy. It explains the green, blue, and purple, my WW, because not everybody knows, because not everybody's a member. Let me just do it on your own. I'm not, I'm assuming you could probably buy this book either at a WW Center or online. I don't really know, but I got mine in through the Wellness Wins. All right, let's read what's in for breakfast. Just like banana bread overnight oats, pumpkin and spice oatmeal, multigrain hot syrup with mango, cheese grits with greens and eggs, cheese and chorizo tortilla casserole, egg casserole with hash browns and peppers, Parmesan pasta and pea frittata, tomato basil and regatta frittata. Oh my God, sounds so good. Italian sausage and mozzarella strata. strata. Apple stuffed French toast casserole. Hello. Yes, please. All right, let's go to the next one. Chapter two is vegetarian, page 23. So far, you know me. I'm duly impressed. Vegetarian means. Butternut squash and chickpea chili, super easy three bean chili, portobello mushroom and eggplant chili, Ooh. rice and bean stuffed peppers, Italian vegetable beef bean stew, tomato and eggplant puccinesca, North African lentil chickpea tangine, farro and double mushroom pot, risotto style barley and peas, tortellini with garlicky tomato sauce, regatta and spinach stuffed cabbage, Spaghetti with caramelized onions, to soup, summer tomato, and so summer tomato sauce with pasta. That's fantastic. That's just getting your fresh garden tomatoes and making a quick sauce. Very good. Just a couple more. I don't want to spend too much time because this video will go on forever. 
Not that you don't enjoy it. Not that I don't enjoy it. Let's go to the next one. There you go. Updated classics. Chicken with celery, root, and apple. Mushroom, tomato, and thyme chicken. Pile high chicken nachos. Yeah. Old fashioned chicken noodle soup. Tomato with white bean chili. Turkey and pepper meatloaf. Spicy turkey meatballs. Low and slow sloppy joes. Italian style pot roast. Brajol in a spicy tomato sauce. Hearty beef and barley stew. Beef and bean chili. Classic Italian meatballs. We all need one of those. Simple delicious lasagna, rosemary garlic pork chops, pork chops with braised cabbage, Sicilian style pork chops and fennel ragu, double mushroom and prosciutto soup. Interesting. Parmesan stuffed artichoke, lamb and regatta meatballs, regatta, and sauce, San Francisco fisherman stew, garlicky shrimp and charred fennel and creamy tomato soup with crab. Oh yeah. That would be a hit in my house because we all love tomato soup here. Yep. It has half and half. Tomatoes. Looks pretty good. Global favorites. I'm going to go real quick. Thai coconut curry chicken. Chicken tacos with pineapple slaw. Oh my gosh. Moroccan chicken. Szechuan chicken and broccoli. Thai curry with noodles. Moroccan chicken soup. Vietnamese lemongrass chicken soup. Jamaican jerk chicken. These do not sound like WW. I mean, like a, like a healthy choice, but they are. Mojito style steak tacos, beef carnitas tacos, Korean food truck tacos, beef soup with lemongrass and coconut, Marrakesh style pork, teriyaki pork tenderloin, five spice pork stew, sausage chicken and shrimp stew, pork and green chili sauce, Indian fish curry, hot and sour soup. Oh my God. Jamaican jerk, Mexican chicken soup. I'm telling you. Yeah. You know, you know, you know, you know, you know what I'm going to say about this cookbook. So, seriously, yeah, that chapter alone is worth the price of admission. Because who doesn't like to make to me global favorites? Meals for two, classic chicken cacciatore. If you saw my hand, I did make one. Chicken tiki masala, Provenca Provencal style beef stew. Lamb tangine, bouillabaisse, vegetable bouillonnaise, cauliflower paprikash. Soft polenta with pecorino and mushrooms. Oh my gosh. I'm um, just saying. 169. Try to go to the next chapter. Instant fryer and air fryer specials. How to do white rice, plain yogurt. Hello. Chicken stock. Hummus, applesauce, rich history style chicken. Yeah. Only thing it doesn't have. Is dessert. Now, mind you, not every cookbook has that dessert. But, yeah. You know I was going to say that. I don't know if there's, I have made a cookbook I didn't like. But, I, like I said, I love how they put it together. And, again, this is hearty beef and barley. So, pull that one up. Gives you all the points for all the plans. See it right there? Right there. Yep. Which is kind of nice because... Some of us are green, some of us are blue, and some of us are purple. Yep, tells you it's low salt. Cook time, prep time, how it made serves. Gives the nutrient nutrient information. I'm telling you. And it cost me nothing. Just tracking and getting weighed and attending my workshops. And I earn points. So if you don't, if you have the app and don't utilize that, please do. You win stuff. Yes. There's a speaker. I have a, um, I have like two cookbooks from there already. I have wine glasses, earrings, which I returned. I didn't like them. They were too big. But other than they have some really cool gifts and they're really nice. Those wine glasses go for, I think like $19 each and I got two of them. And it measures the wine on there. It tells you how many points. Yeah, so winner, winner, cookbook dinner. Yep, you know I was going to say that. You know I was going to say that. But I just want to share what was in it and... Definitely, definitely. I mean, like I said, the international one was just fantastic. Oh my gosh. 
and it has like especially for the purple plant it's got a lot of the grains in here which is really kind of nice because it's nice yeah you, know, you know you have these grains you need to have to how to pair them and put them Indian fish scurry oh I'm telling you and, it's, and the ingredients are not bizarre like you can go to your regular store and get them so if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up if you haven't already subscribed please consider subscribing dish with d does informative vlogs she does cookbook reviews she does live tea with d she does some cooking demonstrations she does she shares um her life here her life on ww so if you enjoyed it let me know in the comment section below let me know what you're what, if you got this cookbook what do you think i'd be love to hear it have a great day we will dish another day i think i'll do the hungry girl magazine see you soon